today we headed up to the mountains. I'm about 20 minutes outside of where I'm going to be doing some fly fishing today. Um, I'm going to go to Brevard, which is just outside of Asheville, North Carolina. And uh, it should be a pretty good day. It's a little bit cloudy right now, um, but the sun's supposed to start breaking through around midday, so that should be good. And uh, the report looks awesome. It's supposed to be a four-star day on the water, so hope we're going to get some. We'll see you on the river. So I just pulled up to my first spot. Um, the weather dipped a little bit. It's about 57 degrees right now. Um, I'm probably not gonna fish like this exact same area because there's actually like this really cool waterfall right here. So I'm probably gonna go behind it where there's gonna be more pools. At least that's what I've been told. Um, but check this out, it's sweet. Go check that out and um, get to fishing in a little bit here. Definitely cool. Super easy to get down here too. A little slippery on these rocks. Unreal. Spot is so cool. There's a couple of pools like in front of me, but it looks way too shallow to even be fishing. So I'm thinking up behind the falls is probably going to be a little bit better. Probably some more pools back up there. But I'm just going to stay down here and kind of enjoy this for a little bit and get some cool videos and stuff. I don't know how well you're going to be able to hear me, how loud this waterfall is, but pretty chilly down here, I'm not going to lie. I don't know how long I'm going to be staying down here, but it's just awesome. Alright, so that was super sick. Glad I did that. Got some cool filters on my uh, film camera too. Well, hopefully they're cool. I'm not really sure yet until I get them developed, but looks like they'll be cool. Um, like I said, I'm going to try and go up a little further, see if I can find some pools up above the waterfall, and then uh, go from there, get in the river and start fishing. All right, so I just pulled up like literally right around the corner, which was super convenient. Um, I'm just gonna scout it out first, see what I can find out here. It's already looking like it's pretty solid, um, but I'd rather you know know I have at least a couple spots before I get all suited up and get all my gear ready. So I'm gonna do some due diligence and then uh, go from there. But yeah, check this out. I'll see. Hopefully this turns out to be a pretty good spot. Still looking pretty shallow in here, but I think I'm just gonna, because how easy it was to get down here and park right here, I think I'm just gonna get on all my stuff, hop in here, and then start wading up river a little bit. It literally cannot be easier. <laughs> Got my lucky fishing socks on. I got fish on them. Taco Brothers. That was sick.
I'm going to put that on backwards. That's better. I'm not really sure what I'm going to throw on yet. Looking online, it said that during May time, something yellow. A good hackle, maybe. I'm trying to decide too if I want to do like a hopper dropper, do a nymph down low, or just to start out with this. I'm gonna start with this guy. we're gonna be throwing this guy which is a rainbow warrior I believe probably wrong but I think it's a rainbow warrior there she is hopefully this will do the trick This looks good. I just can't get too much of a bat cast in. I guess I don't need to go too far back, honestly. Yeah, let's try this spot for a little bit. See if there's anything in that pool right there. I'm tell you my thought process here. Fish jumping right in that area of that pool. So I'm gonna cast behind up by that, that mini little waterfall by that rock, just to the right of it. Kind of let it drift down right back towards me. See if we get any luck. What happened to me right now? Shiza. All right, a few more casts in here and then let's move on up. I'm shocked that nothing is hitting right here. I mean, this looks prime. I keep seeing them bopping up still, but 
might just not have on the right fly. That was a bad cast. That was even worse. Maybe we'll get lucky. Yeah, snag one up. There we go. Alright, one more. There she is. is acting a fool. Damn. <laughs> Get it? I don't know what's going on with this thing. About to start not even using it. Probably isn't even gonna be worth it, but we're gonna try anyways. Just gonna do a little bow and arrow action here. Wow, that's really pretty up there. I don't know if you can see that. Sun's starting to peek through a little bit. That's always a good thing. Hopefully it sticks around. Ooh, there's a little creek chub right there. not expecting to have to be crossing something like this out here but I'm gonna have to do it thinking about going like right along there and getting on that side because this way is just even messier so, wish me luck Ooh. not too bad even halfway there yet. I think I'm gonna drop down actually. Go down there. Hop in the water and just jump over that stump. Strong enough. Nothing to it. Oh, 
little sketchy, but we did it. Definitely gonna be taking the road back. Almost got hung up. I don't think there's anything in here. At least right here. Trying to decide if I want to jump down here. I'm thinking about moving spots. It's just really narrow back up in here and it's not opening up too many pools, but I'm trying to decide if I want to spend time in here or just call it right now and walk back to the truck. Something's telling me I should jump down there. Let's do it. Got nothing to lose. This is where being a lefty is really kind of an inconvenience. Could stand here and just cast it to my right, but I have to keep moving down. There she is. I'll leave in. Went over it. Found my buddy. This thing is so sick. The rod holders. The camper's dope too. I think I'm gonna try this spot for a little bit and then move down river if it's not working. There's a pool right there. That I'm kinda have my eye on right now, but I don't know. All right, I think I'm gonna switch this up a little bit. This spot is really good. I don't know what to switch to though. I'm thinking that I might throw on like a parachute Adams or I might just change my midge down low. Um, make this a little longer too because I'm noticing in the water, it's not getting very deep. So I wanted to get down a little more because this pool is pretty deep right in there. So might throw on a different little midge and then go from there. Really? How is that even possible? Come on, man.
Alright, there's a couple fish right in here. Try and sneak up on them. Alright, so that was probably like the most excitement I've had all day. Fortunately, it didn't land a fish. There was like four or five swimming like right behind here. And I was just trying to bow and arrow them, but they just were not interested at all in what I had on there. So, I don't know if I should switch it up again or just keep going with what I got. But, that was exciting. I got my like heart pumping and I don't know. I love that. So, hoping that I'll be able to land one here pretty soon. Looking like it's starting to pick up, starting to get a little bit warmer. The sun's definitely peeking through now. Looks like we'll have, you know, pretty much blue skies for the rest of the day, hopefully. So, fingers across. What's going on here? Like, I'm not sure if they're dead or what's going on, but definitely think they're dead. Kind of an interesting way to die. fish in here. There's two takes out. I missed setting the hook on. Come on, baby. Come on.
Okay, today is not going quite as planned. I moved again uh, upriver a little more. Uh, there's a fishery really close by, so, and surprisingly, there's not a lot of people in the water. So, this section looks super calm, so hopefully, I'll be able to get out here and get something. But um, that last spot that I was at, probably couldn't hear me because I was close to that waterfall, but I had like four takes and none of them were setting on the hook. So I don't know what I was doing wrong. I thought I was doing everything right. Clearly something is not going right, but we're staying helpful. This spot and then one other spot is probably gonna be the, the last two spots that I go to. So fingers are crossed. What's up, buddy? Might have been a sign from God to throw on like a big terrestrial. So might just do that. I have something that looks just like that too. So I think I'm gonna do that. Never seen anything like this before. Wow. Could be wrong. This looks like a baby copperhead. Do not want to make him mad. snake I think he's a good snake I think it's a rat snake not positive definitely not a snake expert but that didn't be Dude. All right, I'm calling it. I got to get back on the road because I got to head back down to Charlotte. Um, it's pretty discouraging. It sucks knowing that there's a ton of fish in here swimming all around me and I'm putting the fly right in front of their nose and they're not even taking it. It sucks, but that's just the way it goes. So still fun, you know, being out here and being able to get the chance to fish all day. So not complaining. It just, just would have been nice for it to go the way that we wanted it to. But that's all good. I'm saving up for a monster. So hopefully next time we come out, we'll uh, be able to do that. So yeah, like I was saying, heading back to Charlotte. It's about a two and a half hour drive, which isn't too bad. Just would have been better if I could say that I caught a fish when I get home. But it's all good. Um, I'm probably going to start doing a lot more trips like this just because the weather's getting better. You know, it's starting to heat up. Hopefully it'll... Uh, end with me actually catching a fish in the next episodes but you have to stay tuned for that so yeah if you uh enjoy content like this make sure you like and subscribe and um we are on the road to 100 subscribers um i know it's not a very you know, big number but it's a start and it's a uh, it's a milestone nonetheless so i think we're at like 76 77 subscribers so um yeah, your support is huge, and um, I really appreciate all of it. So, um, with that being said, until next time, we'll see you out there. Peace. Sunrise to sunset, baby. Let's go. Cool.